Hey beautiful people, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Nadia. I'm gonna give you guys a quick video that's a dupe of one of my favorite, I'll say old time perfumes. I don't actually own the perfume as we speak because every time I go into Ulta to repurchase the perfume, they're out. Them like everybody else has not been able to restock on a lot of things. So <clears throat> I still wanted to come on here and maybe if you guys love that perfume also, you can go buy the dupe for it like like, well, I had the dupe for a while or whatever, but then I realized, oh, this is a good video because this is actually a dupe for that perfume. And maybe people don't realize it, but the perfume that I'm talking about, since I don't actually have, I threw my bottle away because it was empty. Since I don't actually have the bottle, I will show you guys here what the perfume looks like. And it is Chance Chanel. It is the pink one. Okay, there's a pink one and there's a green one. Now, I'm not a fan of Chanel fragrances. They're a little too on the very much mature side for me. But this Chant Chanel is definitely a beautiful scent. It smells so good. It is very girly. It's not a super like an older mature scent. It's just a beautiful fragrance, okay? So the dupe that I have is a spray. It's a fragrance mist. So it won't have the same sillage as the actual perfume does but if you're like me and you're a sprayer and you are a layerer <laughs> you can definitely get this scent to last because it does smell very similar to the actual chance itself and this is surprisingly Victoria's Secret first love and it is the green one okay it is a very light green color I know that you guys can't tell on camera but it is a very light green color um, this smells so good I bought this not knowing or not realizing that it smelled <laughs> it's crazy that it smells so similar to the Chant Chanel until I started wearing it more and I'm like god this smells like something that I have had before and I realized that it is the Chant Chanel so this is a very good and a very cheap dupe. That Chan Chanel will run you easily $100 a bottle. Well, this spray, which is a 8.4 fluid ounce, is $25. I'm not a fan of Victoria's Secret sprays. I love Bath & Body Works sprays. Victoria's Secret sprays, I have a few, <clears throat> excuse me, but most of their mists do not do it for me. But this absolutely does it smells so good i'm sure by now maybe you guys have smelled this before and maybe you knew that it was a dupe but for those of you that did not or didn't realize or have never paid this any attention but you do know what the chanel smells like go in there and re-smell this and see what you guys think and let me know in the comments if you feel like this is a dupe we may not have the same nose we you may feel like oh it's not i don't think they smell anything alike but when I smell this, it smells exactly like the chance to me. This even has a pretty strong scent to it, even out of the bottle before it is sprayed. Um, but it's a mist, so I'm not expecting it to last as long as an actual perfume does. But it does have a very good... Let's see if I can get some notes off of this for you guys. So it says that first love... Um, the heart of this fragrance the heart of this fragrance combines two delicate first blooms of spring budding violet leaf and lily of the valley pure and green in scent these notes mix with soft sheer musk for a skin hugging and effortless feel that's what it says about the notes which may or may not help you but <laughs> okay guys so the notes on the chanel i guess chanel Utendre, like I said, it's the pink one, and it is a floral, fruity fragrance. Uh, of course, it's an old perfume. It was launched in 2010, so it's not anything new, but I just wanted to come on here and let you guys know about what I feel. I'm not going to say what I feel. It is a very, like I said, it is a very close dupe to this uh, Chanel Utendre. So the notes on the Chanel are, the top notes are 
quince and grapefruit. Middle notes are hyacinth and jasmine. Base notes are musk, iris, Virginia cedar, and amber. You guys, when I tell y'all that these two, this mist, like I said, this is the green one, and the pink one of the Utandre, they smell identical. Identical. <laughs> It is so crazy. Like this, they came out 10 years apart. Like I said, the Chanel was created in 2010. This came out in 2020. I have actually had this since it came out. And this is all that I sprayed. I don't spray a lot because I have so many different perfumes, but, um, and this, it has not lost its scent or anything like that. So don't think that. And they do still sell this. I bought this for someone for Christmas because I love it that much. I feel like I'm like, I want to pass it on to other people that may not go in there to this uh, or pay attention to it or smell it because it smells that good. And like I said, it smells like Chanel. Who wouldn't want a cheaper version of the Chanel perfume? Like I said, it is not the grandma, older lady scent of a lot of the chanel like the number fives or stuff like that it doesn't smell anything like those it is a like i said it is a fruity it's just a very pretty perfume okay so you got to go in there if you don't want to spend a hundred dollars on the chanel perfume just give this one a try it is at victoria's secret for 25 dollars you guys y'all know that i always have to come on here and give you guys the good dupes or give you guys perfumes that i feel like hey this smells good but you can also get that same exact scent for a lot cheaper 25 dollars and it smells i want you guys to go find the chance it's not hard to find well it may be hard to find they sell the i've seen the really big bottles like the 3.4 i'm not buying that i don't really buy anything in 3.4 most of my perfumes are one ounce um it's just what i do they're cheaper but i still get a full bottle and i still get the perfume that i want it's my thing <laughs> but so go smell the chance and then go to victoria's secret and smell so maybe if you have a sephora you know like a mall that has sephora and victoria's secret in it that would probably be best so you're not driving all around town but to smell them both go in sephora smell the chance if they have it and I know we have it in Ulta here, but and then go on Victoria's Secret to smell this. And let me know. Come back to this video and let me know what you guys think. I'm telling y'all, they smell just uh, like 10 year difference in between when they were made. It's such a pretty scent. So that's the end of the video, guys. I just wanted to come on here and share that with y'all. I always pass on the stuff that I love. I don't gatekeep. You guys should know that by now. If I find it and I love it, I'll let you guys know so that you guys can go try it and love it also. It's called sharing. <laughs> I'm just joking. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching another one of my videos. Before you leave this one, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.